Welcome, my name is Grant Harrison. Today, we're going to learn about meatloaf. No, not the American singer that died in 2021. Meatloaf, the food. Well, did you know that meatloaf could be traced back to the 1700s? Let's start off. Let's put your oven. 375. Now you preheat your oven. Grab your favorite bowl. Grab 80% beef. And throw it in your bowl. Boom. Now that you preheat your oven, grab half an onion. And start to chop. Because it needs to be finely chopped. Boom, you're done. Now that you wiped away your tears, grab a bowl. Put your one pound of 80% beef in there. And put your onions in there. Now, grab three tablespoons of parsley. You want this to be chopped up again. Now that's all chopped up, bring back your bowl. Put the parsley in your bowl. Now, grab two loaves of garlic and you're gonna mince them. Now, you put a half a cup of breadcrumbs. Then, one egg. Then, one fourth cup of milk. Then, one fourth teaspoon of paprika. Then, a pinch of black pepper. After that, a couple shakes of Italian seasoning. After that, a teaspoon of salt. Now, we get to the fun part. Let's mix this thing. You know, while we're mixing, did you know that Milo used to be a breakfast food? Now that you're all mixed up, grab a pan like this and spray the inside with cooking spray. Make sure you get all the edges. Now, you're gonna take your pile of meat and put it in there. Whoop. And push it down and make it all flat. Now, go put this in your oven. Now that that's in the oven, let's start making our glaze. In a small bowl, put a half a cup of ketchup. Then, one teaspoon of vinegar. After you have the vinegar, one teaspoon of brown sugar. Whoa. Now, one fourth teaspoon of onion powder. Now, half a teaspoon of garlic powder. Now, a pinch of salt. And a pinch of pepper. Now, you're gonna mix it till it's one good solution. Then, now you're all mixed up. After about 30 minutes of cooking, pull out your meatloaf. Grab the glaze you just made and start to spread it over the top. Now you evenly spread it, put it back in the oven. Now you put it back in the oven with the glaze on it, have a dance party. Pull your meatloaf out when it has an internal temperature of 160 degrees. Then, 
Let it rest for 10 minutes. Now that you've had time to let it cook, dig in.